We've got a real focus on a war memorial today, which is really important to the local community here in Mansfield. And we've selected this because it was referred via the Fix My Street process. So local communities, police officers, anybody can refer in locations through Fix My Street and we will assess that for appropriateness for immediate justice activity. Today is a prime example of that. It's the first referral we've had through Fix My Street. We've responded to it really, really quickly. And we've got people here who have committed offences who are giving back to the community in response to that referral by the community. Yeah, I'm Brendan Gaynor. I'm the Inspector for Immediate Justice and ASB for Nottinghamshire Police. So immediate justice is an out of court option for low level or first time offenders. The idea around that is instead of passing through formally the criminal justice process, they are eligible for an out of court option. So for immediate justice, that is very much around completing reparatory work in the community alongside a learning or rehabilitative element. The rehabilitative element, that learning process is really, really important for us from a preventative perspective in the sense that we don't want to see these people coming back, making the same mistakes. So it enables them to learn, reflect on their decision making and behaviours at the same time giving back to the community. So from a policing perspective, it's really, really quick. It's really, really simple. We follow established out of court referral processes for the community, particularly as we see here today. There's reparation in terms of community um, cleanup, tidy up, litter picking. So for everybody, it's a win-win-win situation. I'm Councillor Andrew Jackson from Mansfield District Council. I'm the portfolio holder for health, uh, safety and wellbeing. And we're here today for the launch of the Immediate Justice Project in the Mansfield area. I think they're really important on two levels. One is to give something back to the local community that they've somehow wronged. But also what's very important is they embark on a programme of education and training connected to this so that they then make better choices in the future. So it's good for the community but it's also really good for the individual, hopefully setting them off on a different path. 